Sarah Duder Blue Dave Odell North Voters, Rally Support for HNP Vet. Cabin City, Philippine State AO City Mayor Sarah Duterte on Monday urged voters here not only to vote for the senatorial candidates of the Huskon and Pasapago, HNP, but also to do something for the country. The presidential daughter presided over a massive rally here Monday and said everyone can help the administration of President Rodrigo Duterte by doing simple things such as cleaning canals and disposing of their garbage properly. In a speech at the Dave Odell North Sports Complex in Durani Nankilan before an estimated crowd of 65,000 supporters, Sarah expressed her family's debt of gratitude to Dave Odell North voters for their support to her father during the 2016 presidential election. Not all of the time a person is given a chance to become the president of all Filipinos, especially that he is from Mindanao. Our family owes a huge debt of gratitude to all of you for the opportunity you have given him, said Sarah, the founding chairperson of the regional political party. In rallying support for the HNP best, Sarah said the administration candidates have promised to help the president in the remaining three years of his term. Sarah campaigned for former presidential aide Christopher Lawrence Bongo, former Philippine National Police Chief Ronald De La Rosa, Presidential Political Advisor Francis Tulan, Tino, Re-Electionist Senator Cynthia Villar, Sonny Anger and J.P. Atercido, Former Senators Jingwe Estrada and Ramon Bong Rettler Jr., Mathine Daniel Rett, Don Mangu Zadadu, Tate Red, Kyle K. Edino, Former Broadcast Journalist Jiggy Manikat, and Ilaco's North Governor Amy Marcos. She says as well found to support leaders' programs and policies. The Dayo City Mayor also urged supporters to make small contributions to the Duder administration. All of us should contribute something to this administration. No matter how small that may seem, such as helping in the cleaning of canals in your homes, proper disposal of our garbage or recycling our waste, that already are a huge contribution to his administration, the presidential daughter said. For her part, she said she promised her father to continue running a progressive and orderly Davao city. During the Hunt's campaign stop in Davao Oriental on Monday morning, Sarah also reacted to a statement by the president on Saturday that he does not want her daughter to run for president in 2022. The president said during the campaign story in Dutidnan of the ruling party, Partido in the Motorcycom Filipino Lockheed Bayan, PDP-Laden, on Saturday that he is not in favor of his eldest daughter running for president to succeed him. Sarah said this was understandable. She said her father's apparent disapproval of her running for the highest position of the land was because he knew the hardship that goes with the job. It's not easy. It consumes the whole of your time. It's like the work of a mayor multiplied one million times, she said. Meanwhile, Clint's campaign story in Navy City was attended by about 7,000 supporters, according to Karen Deloso, Dave Ayo, Oriental Information Officer, said. Slash thank you for watching. Please subscribe.